Hey, welcome to my video on getting stock information via an API with PHP. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get um, the open, closed, volume, um, hot, high and low of each date. I have a Medium article, if you look at the screen right now, that kind of explains how to do it all. Um, I tried different APIs. I, I gave you know, nice. I took, took a look at uh, Google. I looked for 96 stock APIs. They all are dead or uh, they're paid. Eventually, I came across this one down here, Advantage uh, Alpha Advantage or whatever it is, um, and tried that out. And so, if you run this with the demo API key, you you can see that it returns um, all the information and all the relevant information. Um, you can look up Microsoft as a ticker symbol. And the close was 83.89, and the close was 83.89. So it's all relevant information. You get a free API key. I've tried it out myself. It works. Um, if it stops working, please put a comment down below, and please also try to find another one that works. And so with that, I, I have a video on Python. I'm also going to do this in PHP. And so what I've done is I've started up MAMP to run my PHP. I opened up a text editor. And I have to navigate over to my MAMP folder. It's under Applications. MAMP. Um, and then you want to go into HD Docs. And then you wanna, I'm going to put a new folder in there called I don't know, Stock. And I'm going to open that. And it's going to open up another folder. And what we're going to do is we're going to send off a curl request, so I'm just going to create a quick file here called index.php so it renders when I load my stock folder. Um, we're going to send off a curl uh, get request because that's all we need uh, to get the actual Python, uh, the actual JSON object. And so we're going to copy and paste all this code in here. I'm using Atom as a text editor. So I'm actually Change this to be your API key, but since I'm just using Microsoft, it's their demo one, so I can just keep using demo as my API key. Uh, make the get request to their URL. You can swap, have this swap in um, other ticker symbols, and then I'm gonna um, execute it, close the curl request, and then parse into a JSON uh, into a, into a PHP object from JSON. That's what that result does, and then from there I can now uh, reference it. Only thing I can foresee not working with this, and if it doesn't work, I'm going to update the, the article. Is that it doesn't like this the syntax? Like it might need a, an error syntax. And so we'll try this first, and save that, and then I got MAMP running. So if I go to local host eight 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 slash stock, since index.php, I don't actually have to plug in the rest of it. And that didn't. That failed. So I'm gonna go back out of into our MAMP folder. Go to logs. Go to PHP error logs. Cannot use object. Okay. So in an array. Okay. I'll fix this on the actual article. Um, okay. Back. Um, I just noticed on if you look at my screen, it's um, if I have to use the hyphen here, according to the internet, in order to successfully use a. Um, the, the special characters and so with that I'm gonna go delete my errors return to here and we'll just try with the first one here and put the hyphen in and so if line 10 doesn't get an error we're successful we need to try to reload that it will throw an error you look at our error it's on line 11 now okay bingo so that works do this instead. I'm doing a multi-click. Um, just hold command if you're on a Mac or control and then click in multiple spots. Alright. Let's reload the page. And there we go. So now we have um, financial data um, relating to a specific date and a specific stock and stuff like that. So as you can see this is all relevant information and that's how you use uh, stock API with PHP. If you like this video, please subscribe and please check my other video. I have the Python one down in the description.